my name is rucha mahajan your your course coordinator department of mass communication jagannath university jaipur here i am going to uh, talk about introductory video and your uh, semester second that is majmc 206a advanced photography here i am going to tell you about the course name of the course is advanced photography there are four credits of the course this is a core category of the course and uh, this is the semester second course coordinator that i am miss rucha mahajan here i am going to tell tell you about course objectives uh, you will learn uh, the photography in this course uh describe photography explain parts of film and digital camera its functions and use of accessories describe lights and lighting applications for indoor and outdoor explain steps involved in printing and in digital photograph practical mode here in photography you will do practical too like making a photo feature on a specific topic by using self clicked photographs from digital to or mobile camera capture three photographs at normal telephoto and wide angle lens respectively by changing the focal length capture three photographs at correct under and over exposure respectively by changing the aperture capture three photographs at correct under and over ex exposure respectively by changing the shutter speed capture three photographs at correct under and over exposure re respectively by changing the iso here you will learn about what is shutter speed what is focal length how can you use uh, the camera on uh, auto mode and manual mode what is aperture what is correct photograph what is under exposure photograph what is over exposure photograph photograph what is iso uh, you will learn about the photography and the camera to tell you about the learning outcomes of this subject of this uh, subject photography here i am going to tell you about first course content there are 15 co 15 units in your course uh, number 1 is you have to define uh, photography like brief history of photography number 2 is working on a camera role of the camera and importance of photography unit 3 uh, in unit 3 you will learn what is, what are the principles of camera obscura in unit 4 you have to explain camera basic parts of single lens film and digital lens film chamber aperture shutter speed viewfinder pantomism memory internal and external in unit 5 you will have to learn camera formats that is 35 mm medium format large format camera design its working simple camera what is uh, compact camera what is view camera what is reflex camera tlr slr polaroid and in next unit 6 uh you will learn about the underwater camera and what is digital camera lenses controlling the images lens perspective what is film speed what is flash gun what is light meter exposure in unit 7 that is principles of photography like focal length uh what is the focal length in the camera what is the controlling ex exposure what is aperture what is shutter speed what is iso what is depth of field in unit 8 we will talk about and we will learn about white balance color temperature characteristics of an effective cameraman qualities of a cameraman in unit 9 you will learn about various types of photography what is portrait photography wildlife nature photojournalism advertising in night social fashion cam uh, crime still life street life food editorial fine art landscape model lifestyle flat lay portrait and wedding these all are the types of photography you will have to learn in uh, these photo uh, photography types in unit 9 next is unit 10 that is lighting you will learn in this uh, unit that is uh, you will learn about the light uh, in this unit 10 that is source of light natural lights and artificial lights nature and physical properties of the light you will learn about all the lights that is key light back light fill light in unit 11 that 
uh, you will learn about direction and angle of light from what is front light what is side top and back light lighting contrast and it's controlled by fill in lights like one two and three pointing light what is three pointing light that is uh, key light that is fill light and it is backlight in uh, unit 12 you will learn about what are lighting equipments that uh, lighting equipments are the very uh, lighting equipments are uh, plays and plays an important role in camera in photography in unit 13 uh, you will learn about digital photographs that steps involved in printing of digital photographs manipulation what is choice of paper what is the choice of printers in unit 14 you will learn about how to convert developed photograph into a digital photograph what is photo appreciation and last unit 5 you will learn about different problems related to photography that uh, what problems a cameraman faces do, uh, while photography while photographing a subject while photographing a object these all are these all the course content which you are going to learn in this advanced photography subject and next is learning outcomes develop appropriate and innovative solutions working within the dynamics of the target market the with consideration of the requirement of an employer or client incorporate the knowledge of photography theories principles and historical practices into the conceptualization and development of effective photographs next is understand both advanced digital and analog camera operations with an understanding of formats photographic exposure depth of field and shutter speed and illustrate proper placements of plane of focus apply the principles of lighting and color theory to a variety of photographic scenarios by measuring evaluating and adjusting light and color to create quality images apply principles of composition to produce professional images select and use photographic equipments and technologies appropriate to the task integrate the principles of photographic language and design as well as knowledge of contemporary visual culture into the creation and evaluation of one's own work in traditional and emerging media and into the assessment of the work of the others content lms has four quadrants as under quadrant one in quadrant one you will learn about e-tutorials you will uh, you will be provided e-tutorials e-content it includes introductory video of the course content videos audios on each unit of the syllabi content quadrant two e-content it contains self-instructional material ebooks web resources research papers and journals and other reference materials is quadrant three it is the discussion forum for raising of doubts and clarifying them on a near real time basis different topics on emerging issues will be uploaded from time to time and students will participate in discussions you you can have discussion and uh, each doubt and uh, each doubt and question will be uh, clarified in that uh, quadrant three the next is quadrant 4. It relates to assessment which contains multiple choice questions, short answers, long questions. In assignments, you have to, uh, you have to uh, do multiple choice questions, you have to do short answers question, you have to do long answer questions. All the above have been uploaded unit wise at LMS next is learning process and guidance note Re relevance of the course pedagogic pedagogical processes live classes will be there assignments uh, would be provided quizzes uh, will, uh, would be there faqs and clarifications of journal misconceptions Ad additional activities uh, what are the additional activities in this course master classes would be there lecture lectures by industry experts and professionals case studies etc next is reference book there are so many reference books uh, available uh, regarding this subject like op sharma practical photography book hill pocket book my uh, michelle and uh, langford basic photography next is handbook of photography next is photography that is a harder headline you can opt so many books regarding this subject thank you so much